if there's another, if there's somebody else out there that, that is trying to start a tech company, but they're not a developer, um, they, you know, they, maybe they were a finance major, maybe their background was sales or whatever, but they're trying to start a tech company yeah. and, they're, and they're young. What would you tell them now based on what you've learned so far? What kind of advice would you give them? Um, for one, I'd say check out the no code community. It's um, blowing up right now. There's a ton of great, you know, platforms and tools out there. They're like very well VC funded companies that are doing this. Mm -hmm. um, so go that route first. I mean, if you have the means to fund it for a while yourself, do it. Um, actually, one big piece of advice I would say before even doing that, um, you can create Google ads on an idea before the idea is even created. And you can basically look at um, what's the click through rate of you know, how you're positioning an idea just to see like, are people interested enough? And it's a very cheap way to kind of test different hypotheses. Wow, great tip. That's a really good tip. Yeah, I would combine that with start a, start a Facebook page on the topic, start some social media on it and see if you get a following, see if anybody gives a crap. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> The Rider Flex podcast features entrepreneurs, business executives, and the stories behind how they got there, as well as daily tips on career advice and job interviews. Our show can be heard just about anywhere these days, but you can visit riderflex.com and click on the podcast page to hear all the previous episodes and learn more about the recruiting and consulting services we provide. Contact us at the email address info at riderflex.com or 888-964-5876. Thanks so much for listening. And if you enjoy our show, please be sure to subscribe to our channel and like the episodes.